What's going on guys, I'm Solo Bennett and welcome back to another 180 Drifting here on CarX Drifting Online. Today we're going to be looking at the Flash. Now I love the R34, it's a really really cool car, really really nice looking too and it was well overdue for a bit of a uh, makeover. So I thought I would go ahead and switch up the montage a little bit there and try and make it more of a cinematic style. You know it's, it's a bit rough but uh, you know everything gets better with time, hopefully. <laughs> So uh, I also apologize for the lack of decent tandems in that little montage there. 
It's been a real struggle the last two days to try get any decent footage. The, the lobbies have just been absolutely horrendous, so I do apologize for that. I just had to kind of uh, work with what I had at the time, so it wasn't the best. I'm not 100% uh, satisfied with that footage, but hey, it's pretty late right now. I've got work in the morning, so it's just going to have to do for this video, but hopefully you guys enjoy it. Let me know down in the comment section below what do you think of this tune what setup changes do you did you make yourself now this isn't the fastest tune setup out there you can definitely make this thing a hell of a lot more faster but i wanted to make this build more of a just a nice looking car which is going to get sideways which is really really easy for anybody just to jump into and have a, a really good time in this car nice and cruisy it it holds good speed it holds good angle and it's really consistent so if you're a newer player to the game this is going to be a really really easy tune for you so i would highly recommend checking this one out before you try any of my other ones at least on the channel so with that said guys i'm going to shut up now and show you guys the tune setup Now with this, actually, I'm just going to quickly intervene right here. I would probably put your brake torque uh, pressure, whatever the hell it's called in the game, Newton meters of torque. I would probably push that down to around 2000. Uh, you would have noticed I actually fell back quite a lot because I'm not actually used to running 2500. I always run 2000. So my brake pressure was a little bit off. So I would recommend bringing that down if you do find yourself falling back a little bit too much, which is what was causing a few of my issues today. And that is pretty much the tune guys hopefully you enjoy it like i said at the start let me know what changes you made to make it feel better i really do like your guys feedback also if you guys haven't already you already know what to do subscribe if you haven't subscribed show some support by uh you know slapping that like button and if you want to completely up to you you can also hit that uh, little love heart icon on the screen as well and go ahead and you know show some more appreciation if you want to but anyway guys that's going to be it for me today hopefully you enjoyed this video if you want more of this style of video it is a little bit longer to, to make, but uh, it's definitely fun to make as well. So once again, guys, I'm Solo Bennett. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.